patient self-scheduling and therapy appointment. In order to allow your clients to self-schedule via the patient portal, you will need to ensure you have enabled your settings to allow this feature. To do this, select My Profile on the left side menu. On the resulting screen, you can scroll down the page to find the Patient Portal section, or better yet, use the right menu selector and choose Client Patient Portal Settings to jump directly to the section. At the top of the page, we now see Patient Portal as the section header. Ensure that the answer to the question, Allow Clients to Schedule Online? is set to yes. In this case, it says no. To change this setting, I'll select the blue Edit button, change the selector, and then save the change. This will now take us back to the top of the Your Profile page. Next, we need to set some rules surrounding patient self-scheduling. Let's go to Client Portal Settings again and choose Online Scheduling this time. Read each question and determine if there are any of these settings you wish to change. Use the Edit button again, change your selectors as you prefer them to be for your practice, and remember to save your changes. Now, you need to ensure the session types you are allowing clients to self-schedule into are selected. To do this, go to Practice Settings on the left side blue menu, select the Billing and Insurance tab, and view the CPT Code section. Click Setup to open the CPT Code list we asked you about during our account setup time. You can see that the CPT codes that I want to use in general are checkboxed to be active and available for the provider to use, but you will need to ensure that the patients can schedule into them by checking the box under the Client Can Schedule column on the right. In this case, I'm going to allow clients to schedule into either an individual session or a couple family therapy session, but not the others. Be sure and scroll down and choose the Save button if you're making any changes. Your clients are now able to self-schedule, and here are the instructions they will be given. Log in with your username and password. Select Schedule New Appointment and choose the appointment type that you are scheduling into. Scroll down on the page to view the next available upcoming appointment or use the Date Finder tool to jump to a particular date on the schedule. Choose a selected time and use the Schedule Appointment button to save your selection. You will arrive back on your dashboard screen where you can view your upcoming appointments. Let's go take a look at our provider schedule where you can clearly view the patient selection is now displayed on our calendar.